So, Corey, what is equality? The condition in which everyone has the same rights, a condition of which no slavery is present. Since rights are a birthright, this would mean people are born equal by their base nature of everyone sharing humanity. Since they're all human beings, they all should have the same rights because they're all the same. Uh, no one person can have any more or less rights than anyone else. People can only be kept away from exercising their own rights or their own life, their own property themselves by others doing wrong to them, not allowing them to be human or express themselves or uh, by their own belief that they need permission from an authority in order to exercise a right. So an individual may not want to express their life, their selves, or their own body, their property. They may not even recognize it's their own unless somebody gives them a piece of paper or says, this is how you determine that it's your own. Uh, by this man-made thing that we create for you, you have to get permission from us in order to be free, in order to have your freedom. And so that is not equality because you have to get permission. And so any action that is right is an action that promotes equality. Think of the golden rule taught across nearly every culture. Do unto others what you would want done unto you. And that is something we see like literally in every single culture. I even have a book with like literally a list of quotes from um, every single religion out there. And I'm telling you, like it's it's got like most of them um, at the end of this. And it's called the Tao of Right and Wrong. I'm pretty sure I didn't show this one before in our series. But I think it's a, it's a good book because it goes over just how there's a shared theme among every single culture just to keep this this general rule of thumb. And the reason why is because how could you have any order in society if people can't get along with one another or don't treat each other with respect the same way that they would want to treat themselves with respect or say, well, man, I got hurt. I don't want to see this guy get hurt just out of human decency, empathy. What do you think, Aaron? Yeah, I think that's right on point. You know, uh, rights usually end where when you make a claim on someone else's rights, you know, uh, you can't, you know, it's, Making a claim on someone else's rights is not equality. Hmm. Yeah, and, you know, again, everybody's rights should be respected, but then they probably should also be taught, right? Because if people don't really know their own rights or they really are afraid to defend it, um, they don't have the power enough to defend it for themselves, there's a level of strength involved, there's a level of will, there's a level of knowledge um, and I think, you know, you, you see this in children. We've talked about this before, perhaps, but kids, as they grow up in the world, they develop their reason, they develop their strength. And so they're able to take care of themselves. Now, can they help others as well do the same when they grow up <clears throat> or when they uh, develop in the world or uh, interact with others? That is how we create equality is when we each share uh, with one another the truth or share with each other um, what is truthful living truthful living meaning something living that is abiding to everybody and everything it doesn't hurt anything it, it allows order it doesn't allow chaos chaos is just everything happening crazy nobody knows what's happening but you can see equality sort of like order would you agree with that aaron like where it's like people are getting along because of the mutual respect because everybody's kind of on the same page as to how to interact with one another yeah i think you know it it's it, it's learned from the beginning of, of childhood, you know, uh, in having children interact from the very beginning, they learn these things, uh, you know, just just by experiencing it. And, you know, maybe, you know, oftentimes they learn by, you know, wrong behavior and they learn the boundaries and they learn they learn, you know, where their rights actually are. And I, I think uh, in our culture and in our, you know, in the world that we live in today, sadly as we get older that you know we we talk ourselves out of these things whereas they were really simple when when we're children so the next video we're going to talk about inequality so feel free to watch that and check out more of these videos but you know when people usually think of equality they may think of women's rights or certain groups of people's rights and i'd say well why not every one of those people's rights why not all of their rights because everybody is a human being that's something we all share deep down like that is the root to what all of us are regardless of all the labels or anything else we add on top of that so if we get to the root of it well that is where our equality is found why because that's where our rights are found 